हाय फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई डिस्कस क्रोमेटोग्राफी क्रोमेटोग्राफी इज यूज टू सेपरेट यूज टू सेपरेट मिक्सचर दैट कंप्राइजेज दैट कंप्राइजेज सोल्यूट्स that comprises solutes that dissolve in same solvent dissolve in same solvent to this to separate mixture that comprises solute that dissolve in same solvent this method gets its name from the greek word for color name derived from greek word for color greek word for color said chroma said chroma as it because it was first used because it was first used for separating colors for separating colors for separating colors c o l o u r s for separating colors so basically chromatography is based on different differential affinities of compound towards two phases stationary and mobile phases stationary and mobile phases so for example chromatography is used for separating colors in dye separating colors in a dye in a dye in this diagram separation of dyes in black ink using chromatography is described this is a strip of filter paper this is a line drawn by pencil and this is the spot of ink so this is the apparatus this is glass rod this is paper clips this is a jar this is a strip of filter paper a spot of ink and water so this is the method to used separating colors in a dye based on based on nature of stationary and mobile phase chromatography is four types chromatography is four types the first is paper chromatography paper chromatography the second is column the second is column chromatography the third is thin layer the third is thin layer chromatography and the fourth is gas chromatography and the fourth is gas chromatography so this is the chromatography process so i hope you understand i hope you understand what is the chromatography what is the chromatography so now i describe this diagram how to separate colors in a dye the ink has water as the solvent and dye is soluble soluble in it as the water rises as the water rises it takes the particle of dye along with it it take the particle of dye along with it if i take uh, us a separate diagram 
that if this is a beaker, then on this, filled on water, filled off water, some substance like is this, 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 so this blue color is solvent front, sorry this, this, uh, li this line is called solvent front, these three are these three are separated dyes, separated dye, and this is a solvent, and the last one is also a dye. This is a man dye. So now this process is used for chromatograph used chromatography to separate colors in a dye, and its first it was first used for separating colors first used for separating colors now discuss principle the ink had water as the solvent and the dye is soluble in it as the water rises it takes the particle of dye along with it along with it since the dye is made of two or more colors the color which is the most soluble the color which is the most soluble rises faster and high since you since you, uh, you take you uh, see the observe this diagram the blue color is on top of the level so blue color is most soluble so rises faster and higher this is why there are differential differentially color spots on paper which are in solubly label the, this color has more soluble than this, than this, and than this. And the last one is dye. These four are separated colors, and the last one is dye. So I hope you all understand what is the chromatography, where I used chromatography. So please download the Scholar Learning app, and if you already download this, then enjoy learning. Thanks to watching this video.